Good morning. It is April 23rd, 2009. Yesterday I did a hot pepper garden and I thought I would share with the world and show you how I did mine. In this picture it shows that I made the shape that I thought would look nice and remove the grass. Okay, now it's time to get all that edging nice and straight because we're going to be putting in some nice edge work to keep the grass out. Here we go. Now you see that the edging is going in. Remember to put it at the height you would like. Pack the soil as you go. That way it won't move around on you. As you can tell, I have most of the edging in. If you look uh, around the top edge you see where I have been packing it down as I go and this has helped uh, keep it from moving on me I'm about ready to uh, cut the edging and make it a nice finished look I brought the edging up and made a little mark and eyeballed where I thought it should go if you happen to make your cut just a little bit short just remember you could pull in the edging and fill in the outside of it it's really no big deal Alrighty then, we have all the edging in and I've smoothed out the original soil that's in there and now it's time to get ready to add the good soil that I want to grow my hot peppers with. I've made up my soil. Remember my soil consists of one part vermiculite, one part peat moss, and one part compost. I've also threw in a little bit of miracle Grow and a little bit of Hydrosorb so this should be a pretty good mix. I've added my soil, smoothed it out, and now I'm getting ready to throw in some seed. As you can see in this picture, it's a finished product. I planted hot pepper seeds in here, one of which is a black pearl. It's a very pretty ornamental black leaf plant, which has fiery red peppers. I also have some jalapeno. Serrano and some chili pekin. Once I planted the seed, I watered the heck out of it. So now time will tell if it's going to be a success or not. It should be though. I would welcome some comments, good or bad, as gardening is a learning experience for me. And just leave me a note and let me know what you think of my projects. I will be posting more videos as the summer progresses so stay tuned and happy gardening.